I'm trying to read, so stop! Oh, that's a good one! Thanks, Pear! <laughs> no. Attention, everyone! Your attention, please! I have completed my most remarkable invention yet! A cloning ray! Whoa! What's a cloning ray? Why, it's a laser beam capable of creating an identical clone of living organisms. Well, not identical. 99% identical, anyway. I'm still working out some bugs. I know a bug who works out, although I think he's Beetlejuicing! <laughs> Wait, was that a joke? Because I don't understand most jokes. At any rate, here's the big news. I am now ready to test my cloning ray on an actual person! Oh, oh, me first! Me first! Why are you so excited to get a clone, little apple? Because then the two of us can stack ourselves inside a trench coat and get out of the big kid rides! Just hop right up onto the pedestal, little apple. <laughs> Uh, there's a stepladder for your convenience if, uh... Thanks! And now to test my cloning ray! <sighs> Could've done without that! <laughs> Re-aiming and here we go! Wow! How do you feel, little apple? Well, a little under the weather. More like a little under the cloning ray. <laughs> Friends, allow me to direct your attention to the clone animation chamber. Oh, can we call it the clone zone? I think we should call it the clone zone. Trademark! Look, you can see little apples clone forming inside. Whoa! Whoa! Now, the clone will remain in suspended animation until I pull this lever and animate him. He, um, looks kinda big, don't you think? Perhaps it just appears that way through the glass. Light refraction and all that. You know, the sciencey things? Uh, I don't think that's light refraction, dude. What the heck is going on? I thought you said a clone. A clone is an exact replica. As I said, it is only 99% accurate. There is likely to be one thing different about each clone. It appears in this case that that one thing is the clone size. It would be, wouldn't it? Now, would you like to meet your clone, little apple? Why would I want to do that? He can get on the big kid rides without my help. I'm so out of here. Very well. Little Apple's clone will be placed in storage along with the other members of the clone army I'm building. What did you just say? Nothing at all. Who would like to try next? You know, Orange is ready to roll. <laughs> Very well. Just hold still and voila. Whoa, it kind of tickles. It's making me gassy too. <laughs> The process is complete, and it appears to be a smashing success! Oh, no. Um, Dr. Bananas, what's the cartoonishly ominous alarm all about? <sighs> Orange, I think you should sit down for this. Way ahead of you, Doc. No legs. <laughs> this clone is identical to you in every single way, Orange. Sounds like a great guy. <laughs> in every way, but one, that is. Oh, uh, how's he different than me? Oh no, he's not annoying, is he? An annoying version of me would be the worst. No, Orange, it's much, much worse. Your clone is evil. <gasps> <laughs> I'm sorry, Orange, but we cannot let your clone out of the clone zone. He's far too dangerous to have roaming free, and we... Wait, what's happening? Here's Orange! <laughs> Everyone stand back! There's no telling what he might do! Not quite as evil as I had expected, but it certainly is annoying. <laughs> Not evil? Yo, what you talking about? I'm super evil. In fact, I'm about to perform my first evil deed, and it's a doozy. What are you gonna do, evil orange? Yeah, what are you gonna do, evil me? Get this, I'm gonna blow up the kitchen with TNT! <laughs> Hello. It got quiet in here. Evil Orange? Regular Orange does that, like, every week. Multiple times per week, I'd say. Oh, I see. Well, brace yourselves, because I'm about to get even more evil. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! 
Instead of blowing up the kitchen, I'm going to do something far more sinister. I'm going to constantly annoy all of you day after day, week after week, year after year. I'll prevent you from reading things. Heck, I'll even prevent you from having anything resembling a normal conversation. <laughs> um, who's gonna tell him? Uh, Evil Orge, you see, Regular Orge already does those things. He interrupts everything we do with... Please continue. <laughs> uh. If I may interject, it's very, very important that we get Evil Orange into storage before he... escapes. Oh my gosh. You mean to tell me Evil Orange is wandering around the kitchen and we don't know where he is? He could be anywhere, even right here. Oh, what a relief. Yeah, Evil Orange could even be right there. Wait. Uh-oh, which one's Evil Orange? Is it me, or me, or me, or me? <laughs> I, I I can't distinguish them. They have equal evil readings on my evil -ometer. Wait, I know what to do. Orange? Yes, Pear? I have something to tell you. I've decided to ask Passion out on a date. <laughs> Who cares? No, don't do it! The one on the left, Dr. Bananas, that's Evil Orange. Up to storage you go. I think you'll enjoy the other members of the army I'm building. Uh, I mean militia. Uh, I mean book club. Uh, ah, forget it. Well, Orange, I'm glad we straightened out your true identity. It would have been a real bummer if we sent the normal version of you off into storage. Yeah, that would have been a real bum. Err. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I never thought I'd say this, but it's good to have you back, Orange. <laughs> oh, Orange, could I get those red glowing contact lenses back, by the way? I'm doing some experiments to eliminate red eye in photographs, and I need them. Oh, sure thing. <laughs> and also the yellow ones, please. Okay, fine. <laughs> Something momentous has just happened on the Annoying Orange's YouTube channel. He's just hit one million subscribers. But we're not here to celebrate the Annoying Orange. We're not? Boring. So who are we celebrating? You. Me? Yay! No, not you. The subscribers. All one million of them. Whoa, that's a lot of subscribers. I know. And it rhymes with MacGyver. <laughs> Exciting, isn't it? Uh, so what are we doing? We're sending all of our subscribers their very own annoying orange. That's a lot of oranges. You bet it is. Wait, where are you gonna get all those oranges? With this. Whoa, it's me. Hey, it's me. No, I'm me. No, I'm me. You're both right. Yay. <laughs> hey, hey oranges, guess what? Uh. <laughs> Please stop doing this. No, Pear, we won't stop this. We won't stop until there's enough oranges for everyone. So then I told Hamburger he was so greasy, he uses bacon as a band-aid. <laughs> this is a terrible idea. No good can come from this. It's not terrible, Pear. What better way to thank the subscribers than to make a million oranges? Hey, hey, oranges, can you do this? <laughs> What have you done? Oh, Pear, stop being such an apple. <laughs> one good turn deserves another, and this is our way of saying thanks to all of our wonderful subscribers. Without your support, there'd be no annoying orange. Hey, thanks a bunch, MacGyver subscriber. <laughs> hey, that's mine, give it back. No way, it's my whistling pinwheel. You're an apple. What's that, orange? I can't hear you. Oh, what's going on? Wow, what the? Orange, oh, thank God I found you. Who are you? Orange, I'm you, from the year 2053. What? I'm from the future. Okay, wait, so you're me? Yeah, and you're from the future? Yes, prove it. Orange, we don't have time. I have to warn you no. though. Not listening till you prove it. So the lightning and me appearing out of nowhere, that doesn't count for anything? Could have been smoke and mirrors. Well, I have my official 2053 driver's license with me. That could be fake. Not convinced. I've got this futuristic laser gun. Whoa, poor Steve. Now are you convinced? Nope, lame. Well, the only other thing I have with me is this glow stick. What? A stick that glows? 
You really are from the future. That's what I've been trying to say. Can I have a glow stick? No, there's no time. I'll trade you my new iPhone 4 for it. Why would I want that? I have an iPhone 512. How about my golf clubs? No, I'll trade you pear for it. Hey. No, no one's trading pear for it. Just listen to me. Fine. Orange, I was sent here to protect you. Protect me? From who? From an evil future space warlord that can move things with his mind. If he kills you, then I'll never exist. Wait, why won't you exist? Because I'm him. I'm an orange. And I'm you. From the future. So why does he want to kill you? You mean me. Because I'm the only one that can stop him. But I need your help. How's that? You're in possession of the most powerful weapon known to man. Or fruit. Is it me? No, it's not you. Oh. It's the whistling pinwheel. What? It's the only device that can stop him. You don't know it yet, but when used correctly, it can destroy anything. I'll trade you for the glow stick. Deal. No way, the pinwheel's mine. Darn it, Pear, there's no time. Yeah, hand it over, Pear. Nope, can't hear ya. Come on, give it back. What are you doing? Pear, what are you doing? You gotta Pear. give it to us. Give it over. You give it to us. Give it to us. Hey, what are you doing? He's coming. 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 Who are you? Why'd you kill future Orange? Hey, it's me! You're an Orange! And you're an Orange! <laughs> and I'm confused. I was sent here from the future to protect you from an evil space warlord. That's what the last guy said. Well, duh. He was from an evil future. He was trying to trick you into thinking that I was the space warlord, when it was really him. Wow, I'm really beside myself. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm kind of lonely in here all by myself. Mm. Uh. Hey, what's that? Hey, whoa. Hello, that was fun. <laughs> hey, you're an orange. Hey, you're an orange. I'm an orange. I'm an orange. That's what I said. That's what I said. <laughs> hey, hey, orange, you want to hear a joke? Okay. Why'd the chicken cross the... Hey, hey, orange. What? Why'd the orange go blind? Huh? Because he was low on vitamin C. <laughs> hey, I was telling jokes. Get it? Vitamin C? <laughs> hey, hey, Orange. What'd the Orange say before he went to work? Back to the rind. <laughs> hey, that's my joke. <laughs> hey, hey, Orange. How many oranges does it take to screw in a light bulb? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I was in the middle of telling the joke and then you just... Oh, there was a little pulp in that one. <laughs> Gross. What is wrong with you? I think I'm a little ripe. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, I bet you can't do this. Uh. <laughs> oh, anybody can do that. Watch. <laughs> Told you I'm ripe. You're annoying. No, I'm not. I'm an orange. Well, you're... Hey, hey, orange. Why'd the orange fall out of the tree? Because you're stupid. Because he went out on a limb. <laughs> I'm so funny. I tell the best jokes in the world. Hey, Orange. What? What is it, Orange? Nice. Huh? <laughs> hey, Orange, way to go. You've got lots of guts. Get it? Got it? <laughs> Oh, that's a lot better. Peace and quiet. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, whoa, hey. wow. Whoa, oh, hey, watch out. Hey. Whoa. No. Hey, another orange. Hey, it's another hey, orange. Hey, hey, orange. 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 Hey, Blada bada bada wah! Bada dina blada! Blada kabow! Boom boom! Ah! Moo woo!